When I started nursing, it was in 1992. And like most nurses, we go to cure. We wanna help people get well, get over illnesses. Hospice is for those patients at very end of life. And as traditional nursing and most nurses, we shy away from that type of care. You know, it's uncomfortable. Some nurses even say, please, please don't happen on my shift. And that is so wrong. That type of care is one of the most rewarding and needed areas of health care. Hospice and palliative care is a scope of medical care at the end of life, when patients traditionally have six months or less of life to live. We try to help patients at that time period and their family have dignity and comfort and have the optimal life that they have left. We try to keep patients at home and their setting and comfortable and the families as comfortable as they can with the transition that's occurring in their loved one's life. I began looking at hospice care as a profession, as a route, about five years before I made that transition. So I was a nurse many years in many different settings. So I worked med surge, labor and delivery, which is opposite end of the spectrum. I worked ER and ICU, and then community care. There were several patients that touched me. That's why I'm here. There were a few patients that would look at me and say, okay, I'm tired when I would say, okay, let's call and let's do this. Grab me and say, I'm tired. And I thought, well, you know, what I thought has been help all along is not really what everybody needs. And I wanted to be there to do what was next. I felt that early on to be able to hold someone's hand, to treat their, their symptoms, to treat them with dignity and remember the life that they have is a gift and it's a skill set that often in nursing you don't look at in the beginning. It's something that you kind of gravitate towards. You know, to be allowed in a family and a patient's life at that time is a gift to me and it always has been.